today on CWN. Have you been keeping up with your work? Have you got your things from your locker? I'm Jolie. And I'm Michaela, and today is Friday, 2020. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and the Pledge to the Texas Flag. The Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. This Monday is the last day of packet pickup. The last day to turn in packets, books, fines, and to pick up stuff from your lockers will be Tuesday, May 26th, in the back of the school through the bus lane. And I hope y'all are ready at your email inboxes because it's time for your daily giveaway. Here's Kayla with today's question. Thank you, Jolie. Today's giveaway is brought to you by Southern Charm, your local home cooking restaurant, now with curbside service. Today's question is, what new Mario game is coming to the Nintendo Switch? Be the first to email us at callantv at gmail.com with the correct answer to win. Back to you, Jolie. We have a video about the trash and bush that are stacked outside homes. Let's check it out. Have you been seeing trash build up in your neighborhood? Wonder why that is so? Well, it's time for brush and bulky items pick up. People have been putting their trash out by the curb the last week, some earlier than others. Collection begins next week for our area, Area 10, aka Tal Allen, so that pile of rubbish will soon be gone. Some of it may already be gone, as a wise man once said, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Remember to only leave your house in essential times. More things might be opening, but you have to remember to save safe. We caught up with Ms. Martinez about the EOC exams. Let's take a look. Just a reminder, students, if you pass an EOC class this year, you will never, ever, 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 ever have to take that EOC to graduate. So if you are currently enrolled in English 1, English 2, U.S. History, Biology, or Algebra 1, and you pass those classes for the year, the state has given you a free pass and you will never have to take those EOCs to graduate. So please, please, please get busy and pass those classes and all your others. Thank you. Now we'll have the rundown on sports right after this quick message. Mmm, a delicious 50 cent corn dog from Sonic, America's Drive-In. Oh, I can't wait to devour this thing. Eduardo, Eduardo, isn't this the best corn dog you ever looked at in your life? I think so too. Mm, man, this looks delish. <clears throat> give, 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 give me the dog. What? what, what why? Like, give me the dog. <laughs> I'm sorry, Eduardo. You can't have to no. come with me. I want that dog. No. Yes. Give me no, the dog. It's, it's no, mine. Give me the. Give, give it's me the mine. Dog. I bought it. I bought it legally. Give, no. Give, give me the dog. No. 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 No! My dog! Sonic! This is how you Sonic. Thank you, Joe Lee, and good morning, Wildcats. Today's sports is brought to you by Diamond Cut Graphics for all your design needs. All spring sport athletes need to return their equipment back to their respective coaches. Thanks to Doc Dylan, we have a new video on how to stay fit during quarantine. Let's take a look. Welcome, how to do a handstand with Lowen.
That's the latest on Cal and Sports. Now here's Omna with today's weather forecast. What's in store for us today, Omna? Hey guys, and good morning, Wildcats. I'm Omna Zeb. Today's segment of Wildcat weather is brought to you by Ogity Designs and Events. Today we are looking at a high of 88 with a low of 71. Winds are going to be in the southeast from 15 to 30 miles per hour, and there is about a 60% rain chance. Now let's take it to John outside. Thank you, Omna. Right now it feels like we are in the low 80s with some very low winds, and it is mostly cloudy outside. Thank you, John. Now out in our regional radar, we are currently looking at that rain that is clustered outside in our gulf, and we will be seeing that rain headed towards us throughout the weekend. In our U.S. map, we do see that over there by California, down by Florida, and over the Great Lakes, they are also looking at those clusters of rain, and that will be with them over the next couple of days as well. Weekend and on Monday, we will be looking at our highs in the 80s with our lows staying in the 70s and 60s. Winds are going to be generally in the southeast from 10 to 20 miles per hour. And on Saturday and Sunday, there is about an 80% to 50% chance of rain, but that will be back down to 20% by Monday. And that's all from me. Now back to you guys. The winner of giveaway is Miss Cooley. Congratulations. And that's all your announcements for today, but now it's time for your joke of the day. So, do you know why ducks fly south during the winter? No, I don't know, Michaela. Why? It's too far to waddle. <laughs> for all you social people out there, make sure you're following us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at Cat Island TV for all the latest updates. Also, subscribe to us here on YouTube to catch all of our latest videos. And as always, stay classy, Cat Island.